the commemoration of International Rural Women Day convenes stakeholders in the Upper River region. Celebration in Basin, we are led by Reliance Finance Services, which is spearheading the annual observance to strengthen reflection and action on the plight of rural women and promote effort to enhance their empowerment through microfinance development and entrepreneurship. The theme for this year's International Rural Women Celebration is bang on supporting rural women to confront the global cost of living crisis, enhancing their work through digitalization to unlock new opportunities. In 2012, Reliant Financial Services opened branches in all the regions across the country to make financial transactions more accessible and affordable to every Gambian in their comfort zone. Speaking at the event, the board chairperson of Reliant Financial Services, Babu Karakan, said for the past years, they have been closely working with rural women to improve their livelihoods. In the Gambia here, the women now form the majority, even though marginally, and therefore their inclusion can only make the Gambia position itself better in responding to the socio-economic development aspirations of our country. This is why we are working um, strenuously to make sure that in our domain, in our industry, which is the financial services, we are at the forefront to become the first choice for all Gambian economically active women, particularly those in the rural, to have a product or service that they can consume from Reliance. If they don't have, if they tell us, we'll work with them, develop the product and get them to meet their goals. Nelly Tello, an executive board member of Reliance Financial Services said rural women are the backbone of the agricultural sector, contributing significantly to food security and the country's economy. The aim of Reliance Women Finance Program is to provide a springboard for rural women transition from the household chores to entrepreneurship, thereby taking their right roles in spurring the growth and development of our economy. The Minister of Women Affairs, Children and Social Welfare, Fatou Kinde, commended the Reliance Financial Services for their contribution to empowering rural women to boost their incomes while encouraging all stakeholders to support the microfinance agency. She, however, assured the government's commitment to expanding advocacy for rural women entrepreneurs to achieve their aspirations. I have noted that the Reliance Finance Services for the Joint Chapter, the proud host of this year's celebration, are members of the Comprehensive Life Cycle Financing Program, I am particularly impressed that, despite operating branches in all regions of the Gambia, Reliance now takes their services to the doorsteps of the women's schools. This is a safe, this is to save time, to save the valuable time, effort, and cost to go to the branches. Working together, we can create a future where rural women are sufficiently empowered to lead, innovate and transform their communities through secure financial services, outlets, and platforms. Meanwhile, I extend special gratitude and congratulations to you, the rural women in the Gambia and elsewhere. The governor's representative, Pat N. Bale, said it is crucial to recognize the effort of rural women in confronting the global cost of living crisis in the Gambia. Empowering rural women through digitalization, unlocking new opportunities. Since the launch of this program by Reliant Financial Services in 2016 in the Upper River region, uh, more than $380 million has been disposed to over, over 10,000 women. This is not just only significant financial investment, but also a powerful endorsement of the potential that rural women have when providing when providing with the right tools and resources. This by itself is worth of marking International Women's Day as truly a remarkable and memorable event to celebrate and our successful our success and working on improving our challenges for sustainable partnership. The celebration of International Rural Women Day is a crucial reflection on the pivotal role women play in society as household caretakers and first line of healthcare respondents for children. Despite their invaluable contribution, rural women still face significant challenges, such as limited access to education, healthcare, and financial resources hindering their growth potentials. Sedu Kamara, reporting for Jartas News from Basse Upper River Region.